Welcome to the story time with Miss Olga. Don't forget to subscribe. Today we have a new book. That's not my dad. Are you ready? Get comfortable. Open up your listening ears and imagine. That's not my dad. Written by Peter Bentley. Illustrated by John Bendel Brunello. Patty and Dad were on top of a hill. When Patty said, Dad, let's lie down for a thrill. Okay, hurled Dad, and with whoops of delight, he whisked round a corner right out of sight. Where is my dad? Lost your dad? asked Puffin. Puffin, it's this little bird. Can bring it closer to you. This is a puffin. Don't fret, little bear. He slid right behind that big rock over there. All alone, looking nervously over her shoulder, Patty crept up to the ice-covered boulder. There he is, Patty cried, spying whiskers and snot. That's definitely Dad. There his nose sticking out. Do you think it's her dad? Let's see. That's not my dad. Lost your dad? Wobbled Walrus. Why isn't that him? I know how you polar bears all love to swim. So he's pointing here like, oh, maybe he's there. Patty skipped off to the steep icy ledge and carefully poked her nose over the edge. There he is, exclaimed Patty. That walrus was right, as up bobbed a shape that was furry and white. So do you think it's her dad? What do you think? Let's see. That's not my dad. Lost your dad? Asked Seal. He's not far, said her daughter. We just heard him singing down there in the water. Patty dived into the sea and thought, Brr, the water is freezing. I'm glad I've got fur. There he is, Patty bubbled. That's him swimming along. It sounds like his big deep voice humming a song. What do you think? Do you think her dad is over there? Let's see. That's not my dad. Lost your dad? Wondered Whale. If you want my advice, you'll look over there by that hole in the ice. Under the ice, the cold ocean seemed fast. And all Patty's paws were soon paddling fast. Then, through the round hole, she glimpsed eyes and nose. There he is, she thought, looking for me, I suppose. What do you think? Do you think it's her father? That's not my dad. Lost your dad? asked Fox. I know where to go. He's up on that bank digging holes in the snow. The snowflakes were falling, but Patty was swift as she climbed to the top of the deep snowy drift. She heard something scrabbling, then up popped an ear. There he is, Patty cried. Fox was right. 
dad is here. Do you think this is her dad? Let's see. That's not my dad. Lost your dad? Hare said as the snow fell more thickly. He is down there. You'll miss him unless you go quickly. Patty leaped headlong and rolled round and round to the end of the slope and guess what she found. There he is, Patty grinned. That's dad waiting right there. And she waved to her dad through the cold, snowy air. Do you think it's her dad? Let's see. That's not my dad. Lost your dad? Puffin smiled, seeing Patty's dismay. He made you this snow bear to show you the way. A little while later, a deep rumbling sound was echoing out from the hole in the ground. So Puffin and Walrus, Seal, Whale, Fox and Hare all smiled at the snores coming out of the lair. Let's see what's happening. That's my dad. Patty and dad were together again, cozy and warm in their underground den. The end. See the puffin is playing with the hair and Patty and her dad, they're sleeping. Thank you for listening and watching. Don't forget to subscribe and see you again soon.